Hello, welcome to this exclusive webinar hosted by The Cruise Web and presented by Oceana Cruises on the theme of culinary excellence at sea. Thank you very much for joining us today. We really appreciate the opportunity to address all of you virtually. We hope everyone is staying safe and strong. A little bit about me. My name is Morgan Beltayev. I have been with Oceana Cruises for three years as a director of strategic accounts. I am based in Los Angeles. And if you are wondering about my accent, it comes straight from Paris, my beautiful hometown. You might have guessed it by now, just like many of you on the webinar today, I am a total foodie. With this webinar, I would like to introduce you to Oceana's culinary excellence. So without further ado, let's get started. We take our guests to the most extraordinary destinations around the world, curating unique travel experiences aboard small luxurious ships, providing really unparalleled service and delivering exquisitely crafted cuisine, offering simply the finest cuisine at sea. These really are the three main components that makes Oceana stand apart as an ocean cruise lines. We call them our pillars of distinction, small luxury ships, curated travel experiences, and exquisitely crafted cuisine. Today, we will focus on one of, the, one of um, our core brand pillar, and that's the exquisitely crafted cuisine. So without further ado, let's talk about it. Out of our three pillars, this one is really the hallmark of our brand and the one that we get recognized most for, delivering the finest cuisine at sea. We invest more than any cruise line per person per day on our cuisine. Flour is imported from France, as well as all the ovens we bake the bread in, providing the perfect humidity levels to bake the perfect breads. Butter is also imported from Normandy. We serve true AOC cheese from France, Steaks served at our steakhouse are aged for and dried for 28 days before they are served in the restaurant. And if you're a foodie just like me, if you love going to farmer's markets, if you enjoy unique dining experience, experiences, really look no further, Oceana is the cruise line for you. Our dining, our dining experiences really rival the finest restaurants ashore. We have the most extensive offerings of vegetarian, vegan, and gluten-free menus of any cruise lines, and I'll be top, talking about that topic a little more uh, later during the presentation. You can choose from up to 12 gourmet dining venues, and we also have the first dedicated hands-on cooking school at sea, delivering cooking classes for our guests. We offer in-depth, enriching, and insightful culinary discovery tours, and I will be detailing those as well in a little bit. We feature all open seating dining and absolutely no surcharges for specialty dining. Now, let's look at our restaurants. Okay, here we go. Let's start with the grand dining room. In the grand dining room, dine with who you want. The grand dining room is really a tribute to the spirit of Europe's smoky five-star hotel restaurants in a convivial atmosphere. Choose the chef's recommendation with wine pairing or anything else from this extensive uh, menu. With a little nod to Feng Shui, red ginger on board Marina Riviera and Cilerina really radiates harmony and tranquility. It's one of the favorite restaurants on board uh, of, uh, for our guests and it serves a uh, modern Pan-Asian fare. The dining experience is really elevated by your pick of chopsticks as you sit down for dinner. Your maitre d' will come to you with a box of chopsticks, will open it up and you'll get to see the one that you prefer most to dine with. A lot of the uh, experiences are really enhanced with the little details that make those dining experiences really unique for all. Let's move on to my personal uh, favorite, Jack's. It's decorated uh, with art from Jacques Pepin's personal collection on board Marina and Riviera. Uh, Jacques was modeled after a Parisian bistro. This, um, the ambience is purely French and uh, you will enjoy classic French dishes reinterpreted re by uh, master chef Jacques Pépin. And again, this is my personal 
favorite. I love the foie gras there. You can choose the Dover sole. The rotisserie roasted chicken really falls off the bone, bristling with flavor. And uh, the ultimate favorite is at the end of dinner, if you like cheese, the cheese trolley will come to your table and at the end of dinner and you can just pick your choice of cheese and the cheese and the maitre d' will cut it up and plate it for you. And for dessert, don't miss out on the baba with rum. Moving on now to Toscana. Toscana is our Italian restaurant. Dinerware is signed by Versace. Do not put it in your purse, ladies. As you sit down, uh, your maitre d' will come for you, will come to you with a tasting of olive oils and vinegars with some uh, home baked bread. Everything is delicious as Toscana. You cannot go wrong with anything you order. But my husband and I's favorites were obsessed with the lasagna. We could have it every day, three times a day. Uh, if you like steak, look no further and dine at Polo Grill. I will be delighted by Polo Grill's uh, classic steakhouse. It really embodies all the elements of, uh, of a classic steakhouse, st serving 28 days uh, aged steaks cooked to perfection. Um, choose the size of your choice. The lobster mac and cheese is to die for if you want any suggestion. But if you prefer sauteed spinach or broccolini, that's available too. Um, now, before we talk a little bit about the team, I'd like to share some statistics. And this is the it will be the only one, I promise. Uh, the stat that I want to share is our staff to guest ratio. And more precisely, our culinary staff to guest ratio. On board our Okla ships, the Marina and the Riviera, we have 1,250 guests and 800 onboard staff and crew members. Out of those 800 staff and crew, 400 members are de dedicated to the culinary experience. That is half of the entire onboard staff. For every three guests, there is one person dedicated to their dining experience. Our executive culinary di director, uh, master chef Jacques Pépin, provides the inspiration for our gourmet cuisine. Jacques was the personal chef for three uh, heads of state of France, including Charles de Gaulle, and he has served as a host for an array of acclaimed cooking uh, programs uh, in, on PBS. He has been part of the Oceana family since our inception, and he understands really the passion we as a company have for food and delivering an exceptional experience for our guests. And this is really what makes it uh, an, an uh, ideal uh, partnership. Um, we invest more than any other cruise line per person per day on our culinary experience. We focus mainly in three areas. First, sourcing the finest ingredients. We really believe that only with fine and great ingredients can you serve great food. For example, fruits, vegetables, and dairy are all sourced locally throughout each cruise. Number two, so number one was sourcing the finest ingredients. Number two, um, okay, sorry, this is what I meant to say. Creating the best culinary team and providing constant training so they really on, stay on top of what is out there. And number three, providing the finest Michelin star quality kitchen and galleys. Floating galleys. Each restaurant has its own galley of kitchen, so our di your dishes are always prepared à la minute and served at the right temperature. They are not coming at the other end of the ship being carried away and brought, and brought to you to the restaurant. Each restaurant has its own galley, and that makes the delivery even more special. Moving on. Now, the ingredients. Our lobster, for example, is sourced from Maine, where you buy out an entire catch from one particular, when we buy out an entire catch from one particular family of fishermen who have been trapping lobsters for generations. So this is how important the quality of the ingredient is to Oceana. All of our breads and rolls are baked uh, fresh every day over two dozen different varieties. Every meal service in every restaurant has its own unique selection of bread, bread and rolls and breadsticks. Oceana has the only authentic French baguette at sea. Special ovens that measure the humidity in the air and allow us 
to adjust the recipe as needed so the bread is always cooked to perfection. Uh, we use premium French flour. Our plancho flour is custom milled to our exact specification. We have Valrona chocolate, one of the finest in the world, and we make, uh, we make homemade pastas and sauces from fresh herbs and vegetables sourced locally. Now I'd like to talk to you about innovation. Oceana is always looking ahead, tweaking, adjusting, perfecting our culinary expertise. Um, these past couple of years, we've had a series of um, innovations and uh, we've introduced the enhancements that I'm just gonna be talking to you right now. First enhancement is La Réserve, our tasting room. A multi-course dinners are served in La Réserve uh, for, with four different tasting menus. One of them is a Dom Pérignon tasting dinner serving six courses with uh, three different vintages and that's in partnership in exclusivity with Dom Pérignon. You won't be finding this dining experience anywhere else at sea. We offer plant-based menus at every meal. The chef's market dinner at, 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 at Terrace Cafe, and I'll talk a little bit more about that in a minute, and as well as culinary discovery tours. Those are a few of our latest enhancements. Oh, sorry, I skipped, here we go. Um, so what's great food without great wine? Each of our ships have 12 to 20 sommeliers years to go over the extensive wine list we have in each restaurant. From time to time, uh, sommeliers will even source local wines proper to the itinerary and region. On average, we have over 10,000 bottle on, bottles on board, and our wine cellar lists an inventory. Um, our wine cellar list and inventory is revised several times a year to ensure that we have availability and also quality. La Réserve, you can find on Marina and Riviera, is really the ultimate expression of love for food and wine. We offer three different wine pairing dinners in a setting that can just accommodate 24 people. And uh, make sure to make your reservations in advance if you'd like to uh, partake in one of these uh, unique dining experiences. Um, La Réserve, um, so this is a little bit about La Réserve. During the day, it transformed in a wine and, uh, into a wine and tapas bar. So in the evening, it's a dining, tasting menu experience. And during the day, it's wine and tapas, where you can enjoy, uh, enjoy some of the finest wines uh, from around the world, and uh, tasting or uh, glasses or a bottle with tapas and uh, in the evening, um, the full uh, dinner. So um, now on the Don Perignon experience is a six course tasting menu uh, shared with no more than other 24 enthusiasts in La Réserve for 295 per person. Um, our chefs and sommeliers develop this uh, dinner. It's fun, it's enlightening, and of course, very bubbly. Six courses, each course is paired with a unique expression of Dom Perignon to create unique and powerful flavor combinations. And uh, unlike um, our other dining venues, La Réserve does have an additional cost. Uh, here is uh, the menu um, of Dom Perignon. So three champagne vintages paired with two courses, uh, with each with two courses, uh, vintages from 2009, 2006, and 2004, paired with six courses featuring the finest ingredients such as blue lobster, truffle risotto with gold leaf, wagyu beef. I had um, the uh, opportunity to try to try this uh, uh, last year with my husband. We were on board and before you even enter to the restaurant, you are greeted by your name, Mrs. and, um, Mrs. and Mr. Bentayev uh, for us because they, they knew who we were, they were expecting us, they looked for the information and it's very so special to, to be welcomed by your name when you enter a restaurant. Our seats were ready for us and we had the opportunity to dine with guests that had the same affinities that we do, that really enjoyed um, 
uh, pairing uh, food and champagne, and it is a very unique experience. I have to say, it's probably one of the best meal and most memorable meals, uh, memorable meals I've had in my life. So if you can, if you're going on Oceana on board Marina or Riviera, make sure if you have the opportunity to try the Dom Perignon experience. Um, now, on a more healthy note, let's talk about uh, plant-based uh, menus. So. Oceana introduced plant-based menu several years ago. Uh, from a cruise standpoint, we were early adopters. More and more guests want to eat healthy or at least want to have the choice to eat healthy. Um, and what was a niche before has become a lot more mainstream now. So we started with a juice bar on Marina and Riviera. Now all of our ships have uh, the juice bar. And now we offer over 250 plant-based choices across our restaurants. Oceana Cruise has quickly become the cruise line for health enthusiasts, offering our guests healthy culinary, healthy culinary uh, vegan juice bars, 250 gourmet vegan dishes to choose from. We have all group classes are complimentary, including Pilates and yoga. And recently we added more choices to our health and wellness shore excursions. Uh, staying on the theme of innovation, last year we've introduced uh, our chef's market dinner. Uh, the chefs source local ingredients from the region we visit and transform for one evening Terrace Cafe uh, into a farmer's market for guests to enjoy. We have about 20 different themes. I got the chance to experience the French uh, chef's market dinner. Uh, French music was playing, little French flag flags everywhere, uh, staff dressed in berets and aprons, French aprons. You can find fantastic displays of cheese and charcuterie and breads and pastries and olive bars and so much more. It really felt like walking uh, in a farmer's market on shore in France and you get to enjoy all those, uh, all those local specialties uh, when you are on board Oceana Cruises. So um, the Chef's Market dinner at Terrace Cafe a few times a week, not to be uh, missed uh, when you are on board Oceana. Another innovation uh, in the cruise industry, uh, Oceana introduced the first hands-on cooking school at sea on board Marina in 2011 followed by Riviera in 2012. And you can, we can accommodate up to 24 guests. Again, a very uh, unique experience to be had. Uh, and these have been extremely popular. Uh, some of the most popular classes offered are Red Ginger's favorites, so exploring Chinese and Thai cuisine, learning to cook with rice paper and pad thai noodles, uh, creating the perfect tapas party, and love of lemons with lemons in all courses. Um, we were the first cruise line to offer a hands-on culinary school at sea, where chefs actually prepare regional favorite dishes from the places we travel along, um, uh, from places we travel alongside uh, fellow guests. So the chefs and the guests are to cooking together in the culinary center. All right. Um, Oh, here we go. Culinary discovery, discovery tours, those are fantastic excursions. These tours take you from the culinary center into an immersive experience into the cultures and lifestyles of the people of the places we visit. You can shop in a Barcelona, Barcelona market with our chef and learn what types of meats, vegetables, and spices you need to return to uh, you need to return to the ship and to make the best Spanish paella. We offer uh, uh, those tours throughout the Mediterranean, the Caribbean, Australia, and other parts of the world. In Europe, we have two dozen uh, culinary discovery tours designed to immerse you in the local foodie scene. For example, this in the picture is a culinary discovery tour in Provence. It starts out with you in a small group from the ship exploring the local market stores um, as the Oceana chef instructor shares the expertise of the local offerings. Uh, from there, you meet Chef Ren, uh, Chef Ren Samut, a Michelin star recipient at her famous uh, farmhouse restaurant. And during your visit, uh, Chef Ren, she will cook 
and share secrets behind uh, her classic provincial uh, specialties. So uh, a fantastic and again, unique experience um, that uh, it would be very difficult to have uh, by yourselves. Um, all right, moving on to the next slide. Oh, the next slide, oh, here we go. Did they go too fast? Sorry about that. We were here. Voila. Um, this picture now, it's a personal picture and we're talking about culinary discovery, discovery tour. These are my in-laws. They were in French Polynesia and uh, they took a local private island tour with Oceana um, and a family prepared a lunch for them and they got to eat with their feet in uh, the water. So this is uh, the group that took the tour and you can see the family set up the buffet for them and the chairs are in the water and so are the tables and you get to have a very unique dining experience in someone's uh, home, which is a private island and uh, eat with your feet in the water. How many of us had the chance to do that? Again, a very uh, unique uh, experience uh, to, um, to to have. Uh, now the go local tours. Uh, go, these tours are very small group tours that take you off the beaten path and some of them are also culinary focused. One of them, for example, you shop for dinner and set the table in Buenos Aires in Argentina. So you're accompanied by a local guide and this is fun and engaging uh, an engaging afternoon or an evening of shopping uh, the local markets and then retiring to a local residence where dinner is prepared and uh, enjoy navigating through markets, bustling with locals. There would be opportunities to ask the butchers for the best cuts, the fishmonger for today's catch, or haggling with the grocer for the best piece, the best price on uh, vegetables. Um, one really need not to be a foodie to appreciate uh, the richness of this experience. Uh, after the shopping is finished, it is finished, it's time to enjoy a traditional Argentine dinner at home. Um, now, what is included with Oceana? With Oceana, you have absolutely extraordinary value. The transfers from uh, where the ship is docked to the city centers are included. All your soft drinks, teas and coffees are included. Internet is complimentary. All the specialty restaurants are included at the exception of uh, La Reserve. And you can also uh, buy Oceana with air. Um, uh, uh, with air, the, when you buy with air, the transfers are uh, are included uh, as well. Now let's talk about all life choice. In addition to everything that I mentioned, you have a choice of either complimentary shore excursions, complimentary prepaid gratuities, um, sorry, complimentary shore excursions, complimentary beverage package, or an onboard credit. So you, the, the choice is yours. You get to pick one out of the three. We are running right now an ultimate sale with major, a major price reduction. Uh, so take a look and hopefully you'll find the selling that will uh, work uh, for you. Um, in addition to that, we are running a very uh, special, uh, a very special promotion with the cruise web. It is complimentary prepaid gratuities for veranda and above for any bookings made in October between October 8 and 28 of this year. So in addition to everything that's included plus your all life choice, now you also get uh, prepaid uh, gratuities on uh, if your booking is made uh, within the next uh, 10 days. Uh, I would like to talk about our travelers assurance program, considering our the times and COVID. Uh, if you make a booking now, you can cancel up to 15 days prior to departure uh, for booking made by October uh, 30th. You have the peace of mind that you can cancel if you book and you will receive a 100% future cruise credit and the best price guaranteed for your next booking. I also would like to talk about uh, Norwegian Cruise Line Holdings, which is our parent company, Healthy Cells Panel. So we introduced uh, this Healthy Cells Panel, a team of 
cross-disciplinary experts really enlisted to guide the cruise industry's uh, way forward in response to COVID-19. Um, this uh, panel includes Governor Michelle Levitt uh, as a panel co-chair and uh, Dr. Uh, Scott Gottlieb. If you'd like to read more information about the Healthy Cell Panel, I'd like to invite you to visit our website and uh, look at Healthy Cell Panel. We have there uh, the latest recommendations that we suggested to the CDC. Uh, thank you for uh, joining us today. I hope you enjoyed this gourmet webinar. We do have a few questions in the chat box. I will go ahead and answer uh, some of those. All right. Uh, can I bring wine on board if I purchase it prior to embarkation? Uh, how about wine purchased in port? Um, absolutely. You can bring your own wine and wine purchased in port up to six bottles. And if you wish to drink this wine in one of our dining venues or uh, in, in the public area, we will charge a $25 corkage fee. Next, uh, next question. Do you offer room service? Absolutely, yes. Complimentary room service is available 24 hours a day uh, from an extensive menu to choose from. Um, next question, what is the dress code? All right, so we recommend a resort or country club casual. No need to pack the suit and the tie and the ball gown with Oceana. We are a pretty convivial um, country club casual kind of cruise line. So um, for the evening dining, just elegant casual resort wear is uh, suggested. All right, let's read and let's take another one. What is the average class size for the culinary center? The culinary center can accommodate 24 guests in 12 stations, so uh, two people per station, and it is very well attended. So I do recommend booking your class as soon as uh, it opens. I'll take a couple more. Um, is there a cost for specialty dining? Specialty dining with Oceana is complimentary. The only restaurant with a fee is La Reserve, and depending on which menu, there are four total different tasting menus, the price would be slightly different. Uh, but other than that, Jacques, um, Red Ginger, Polo Grill, Toscana, uh, all these restaurants uh, do not include any surcharge. Next question, do I need to make a reservation for specialty dining? Yes, you do need to make a, resp uh, a reservation for the specialty dining. As uh, you may have guessed, they are in high demand. So uh, every guest gets to have uh, dinner in one of the restaurants. Uh, so um, at, up to four uh, restaurants. So um, I really do recommend making those reservations. Um, next question, how does Ocean accommodate guests with dietary restrictions, spe uh, specifically gluten-free diets. Um, we accommodate many dietary uh, restrictions, including gluten-free, low sodium. Uh, just make sure to that all your specifications are noted in your booking, and uh, we can accommodate most uh, of the dietary uh, restrictions. We are uh, running out of time, so I, I am going to stop uh, oops, the questions uh, uh, right, right here. If I didn't get to answer your question, someone from the cruise web team will uh, follow up uh, to, answer, to answer all the remaining questions. Thank you again for joining us today, and I hope you enjoyed this gourmet uh, webinar by Oceana Cruises. Bye-bye.